Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Tonight I'm gonna to be sharing an after dark clean with me. This is one of my favorite times of the day to clean once everyone's gone to bed and the house is nice and quiet. I also love sharing these videos with you guys just because they are so almost therapeutic and just very relaxing and calm to watch. So I hope you guys really enjoy today's video. Kyle is getting some work done in his office. The boys are already sound asleep upstairs. So I just figured I had a lot of time tonight just to focus on our home and kind of taking care of it. As you can see, I have a bit of a mess behind me in my bedroom. I did have to wash our blankets and so I have to finish making my bed, but I also want to decorate our bedroom for fall. And I also just want to start adding a few things on our walls. As you can see, we really don't have a whole ton in here, really just kind of functional pieces. So I want to go ahead and get that a little bit more decorated tonight. And then once we're done in here, I'm gonna move into our kitchen and living room and just get that all cleaned up tonight so that tomorrow we can start off with a clean slate. So we have a lot to get done tonight. It is very late. It is completely pitch black outside. So I hope you guys enjoy watching. Let's jump into it. I wanna hear you say it. Yeah. So as usual, I'm going to try not to talk a whole lot during this video because I am trying to make this very relaxing and calming for you to watch, but I have picked some amazing music so you can just put this up and enjoy cleaning along with me, but I hope that as you watch this video, you can kind of think of things that are going to make you feel more relaxed and more calm in your life. I feel like mindset is something so important in just enjoying our lives a little bit more. For example, the things that I'm doing tonight are not my favorite things. They're not anything that I'm really looking forward to. I definitely am not excited to fold a bunch of laundry or anything, but especially when I am doing after dark cleaning and everything is kind of quiet and life just seems to move a little bit slower, I try to kind of make my mindset match that a little bit more. And instead of just feeling bummed out that I have to be folding laundry or doing whatever kind of chores I have to do, I really just try to find the joy in those things. And while I'm working, I'm just thinking about how thankful I am that I'm able to take care of our home and prepare this space for our family. I think it is a blessing that we are able to do those things and a lot of times we kind of overlook that and only see the work. So next time you're cleaning, whether it's in the middle of the day or if you're able to take a little bit of time in the evening when it's kind of a little bit more peaceful and calm, think about what a blessing it is that you are able to take care of your home and just allow yourself to enjoy the little things in life a little bit more. So before we get too far into today's video, I wanted to say a big thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. I've shared on my channel in the past that I've struggled with depression on and off, and the past year and a half has not been an exception. And I know I'm not alone in that. It has been such a struggle for so many of us emotionally. 
but if you are unfamiliar with BetterHelp, they can assess your needs and match you with your own licensed professional therapist, and you can start communicating within 48 hours. It's not a crisis line, it's not self-help, but it's professional therapy done securely online. I know for me, I have the hardest time getting myself to make appointments to go see someone, so I love that BetterHelp can be done in the privacy of your own home. They are available worldwide and have over 20,000 therapists with a broad range of expertise, which is amazing because I know that's not always available locally, just depending on where you live. And it's so convenient because you can log into your account anytime and send a message to your therapist where you'll get thoughtful responses. Plus, you can schedule weekly video or phone sessions so you don't have to sit in waiting rooms like you do with traditional therapy. Another benefit to BetterHelp is they are committed to facilitating great therapeutic matches, so that makes it easy and free to change therapists if needed. It's also more affordable than traditional offline therapy and financial aid is available. And signing up is really simple. Just go to betterhelp.com slash thiscrazylife, select what type of therapy you're looking for, and answer a few simple questions, and they've got you covered from there. Join over 1 million people taking charge of their mental health with the help of an experienced professional. And to make it even better, BetterHelp is offering my community 10% off your first month just by going to betterhelp.com slash thiscrazylife. If you have been struggling lately, I really hope this helps you enjoy life more. And thank you again to BetterHelp for teaming up with me on today's video. We got love that will never need to hide. Love will always rise above. Whatever comes, we will be just fine. If I am yours and you are mine. Take my hand and let's fly away to another galaxy Hold me close, I want to feel your love Together we are free Just be with me Just be with me Just be Take my hand and let's fly away to another galaxy Hold me close, I want to feel your love Together we are free Just be with me Just be with me Just be with me And they're bringing me into the light Hey, he never said it would be easy No, he never said we would be safe My hope, my hope, my hope, hope So you can kind of see here and you'll see it later on for sure, but I was struggling so much with deciding how to put the decor pieces up and I was really struggling in this area too, just on where we should put these signs. I'm not even sure at this point, like if they really fit in this space or not. I really do love them, but I just feel like because this wall is so big right here, I'm just not sure if they fit really well. So you guys will have to help me out with your opinions on this. Let me know if you think we should move these signs off to the left. That was my original idea, but I just wasn't really sure about it. And then Kyle said he thought we should put them right above the bench and maybe I'll put something off to the left but I honestly could see it just not really working in the space. So let me know what your thoughts are on these. One thing that I was sure about was this print that we decided to put in the cove right when we walk into our bedroom. Originally, we had had our wedding picture in there. That one actually isn't the best quality. It just wasn't really printed correctly. And mostly the reason we decided to change that out was because it just wasn't really a good fit for the space. It wasn't the right shape. And this picture just fits the space so well. So we actually really, really love it here. I do think I'm probably going to end up changing out this mirror right here in the future, but for now, 
this is good. And even though I'm not totally sure about a few of the things that I decided to do in our bedroom tonight, I am so much happier with the space now just because it feels like it's a little bit more filled up and a little bit more cozy. Oh, situation all this pain i'm facing for every dream i'm chasing there's hope whoa, oh, 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 oh. there is hope my in hope, every situation my hope, I could really not get this little area figured out so that's what I have for now but I want to show you guys something I found just like two seconds ago if you are scared of like creepy crawlies don't watch but well this is like the third little guy we found in our house now so it's moving in can you see that it's a little scorpion and it's like a baby. He is dead, thank goodness. But, oh my gosh. Ew. I am so grossed out right now. Ugh, I am so grossed out right now. Our robot vacuum actually got two of them. That's how we found the other two. We've never found a living one in our house. Of course, our cats may have found them, I don't know. But that's the third one now that we found in our house. And thankfully, they've all been dead, but I hate it. Hate it, hate it, hate it so much. Uh, it just like gives me the creeps. So anyway, we're gonna move on past that because now I'm definitely not gonna be able to go to sleep. But we are done with my bedroom. There's definitely still more that I want to do in here, but um, even just like the little bit that I did actually added quite a lot. I love that pop of orange on the bed. So anyway, now that we're done in here, we are gonna move into the kitchen and living room and just work on getting that all nice and clean for tomorrow. Doesn't take much to see you're hurting, my dear. The story's written in your eyes. The past you're hiding from just won't disappear. It breaks you down inside. You fear the life you have. Satisfied, you disconnect so no one else feels the pain to keep the casualties lowered in the fight. Oh, but what you don't know.
restless tug of war you caught in between and it keeps you up at night oh i want to go to war for you no matter what we're up against i promise i'll keep So if you've seen my last few videos, you might have noticed I've edited them just slightly different here and there. I've been adding in a little bit of like the actual sound of me cleaning whatever I'm cleaning at the moment. I find it very satisfying. I don't totally love like the fully ASMR videos just because I kind of like the beat of the music a little bit more, but I've been personally loving just adding a few touches of like the real sound. But you guys will have to let me know if you guys have been enjoying that or if you like just only music and voiceovers or kind of how you've been liking it. Just let me know in the comments kind of what your preference is. But anyway, typically when I do my after dark cleaning, I will just pop all the dishes into our dishwasher and just wash them that way. But once in a while, especially when I'm kind of trying to more enjoy homemaking and not just rush through the process, I will sit there and just wash dishes by hand. I always have a little bit of a soft spot in my heart for dishes and just washing them by hand because it kind of reminds me of washing them by hand with my mom. And so anytime I do a full sink load of dishes by hand, it just always takes me back to that. And it's something that even though I don't love washing dishes, I can definitely find joy in that. You guys will have to let me know if you have something like that where you don't necessarily love doing a certain thing, but you have kind of a soft spot for it because it triggers a memory for you. I know one thing for Kyle is the smell of gas always reminds him of driving around with his dad. And so I know we all kind of have those little things, but it would be really interesting just to hear a few of yours if you have any. But anyway, I am just kind of rambling along, but I hope this video has been bringing you some peace and calmness into your day as you're watching. Get some wrinkles on my forehead I wanna build fires in a house that's made of yours We can drive the kids to school Read them stories from our bed Kiss them on a little tiny fall I wanna lose touch with what's hip and what's current I wanna go crazy in a house that's made of you I wanna grow older, I wanna grow wiser I wanna grow flowers in a house that's made of you I sit and watch the sunset It's me.
Rainy days don't seem so wet Stormy nights don't stay From the moment that we met You were the way Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know Talk for hours and never slept Two silhouettes on the concrete stairs We watched the sun as it slowly crept From the horizon to the place we met Oh, this could be the best thing that I'll ever know So I have been a night owl ever since I can remember, ever since I was a little girl. And so maybe that's why I'm able to find a lot of joy in just cleaning at night once everybody has gone to sleep. And I honestly also suffer from insomnia a little bit. So I think that's kind of another reason is it just keeps my mind busy when I'm not really able to sleep. But let me know if you are a night owl or a morning person. And also if you like to clean during the night or if you'd rather wake up before everyone else and get your cleaning done then or if it just doesn't really bother you to do all of your cleaning during the day. I find that during the day I have so many other tasks that I don't always love to do all of my cleaning during the day. I do like my daily cleaning but I really do just love getting our house nice and clean or at least like the main living areas at night and that way when we wake up it is so peaceful and calm to wake up to a beautifully clean home and it just starts the day off on the right foot for me. So that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really wanted to create something very peaceful and calm for you, especially with how stressful and chaotic the world can be. I think it's so nice to just be able to find those peaceful and calm moments in our lives. So I hope that this really helped you with that. 
And I also wanted to remind you, if you are struggling with depression or just having a harder time enjoying life, don't forget to check out BetterHelp and use my link betterhelp.com slash thiscrazylife to save 10% off your first month. As always, thank you so, so much for being here. Do not forget to subscribe down below if you are not already so you don't miss out on future videos. I hope you are having the most amazing day and I will see you in my next one. Bye guys.